Alexis Sunshine 83, it's always sunny here. Hey Sunshiners, Lexus Sunshine 83 right here. Hello, hello, super sunny day. What is up? Happy Wednesday. Today's video, we are gonna go into a deep dive into my clothing. Um, I'll be the first to say, um, I have too many clothes. I'm definitely not bragging. Honestly, I don't think anyone should own as many clothes as I do, or at least as many denim jackets as I do. I noticed recently a bunch of people are doing decluttering videos, but I will say this is not a decluttering video. I'm not saying which items I'm gonna be keeping or not. It's just what I have in my wardrobe but any items I ever do kind of say goodbye to I put on my Poshmark which I will have linked right down below but let's just get into all my clothes um yeah. I figured we would do my category that I love the most, which are my jeans. I am just obsessed with thrifting denim, searching for that like perfect pair of mom jeans. And all my mom jeans and all my jeans in general are thrifted except for one pair from Topshop that are like these skinny jeans that I really barely even wear. I actually only had them because of my last job. I had to wear like jeans that were flexible and even though they may seem like they look all the same they all fit differently in their own way with their different wash some of them are a little bit big some of them are a little bit small it depends on where am i going am i going to be driving in the car then i'm not going to wear those tight mom jeans so even though i may not necessarily need all these different pairs of jeans they work with different outfits and honestly i'm just so proud of my jean collection and every time i go into a thrift store i will continue to try to find the perfect pair of mom jeans and in most cases most of my jeans are mom jeans it's just what i feel most comfortable in now for just pants you know fancy bottoms I only have three I honestly am still trying to get used to wearing more structured pants basically anything that is not jeans I am definitely not completely comfortable in these are just the ones that I have picked up and thrifted hopefully this category will expand in the future honestly for somebody that lives in Southern California I own way too many just jeans long jeans than shorts but this is my shorts collection um, most of them are just light blue Definitely not a like shorts shorts kind of gal you know my skin touches a seat and it's just ugh not my fave so I try to keep mine a little bit longer just for personal preference. I definitely have my favorite that I got like two years ago but got some different colors all in there. I even have a squirt, yes, a squirt, you know, party in the front and business, wait, business in the front, party in the back. Ah, uh, skirts an enemy of mine for a while. And honestly, I'm still trying to get a little bit comfortable with them. The skirts that I have are a little wild, uh, a little bit different, of course. Somebody that doesn't love skirts has to own weird skirts. Definitely still trying to build my wardrobe up with longer ones because I think that makes the most sense for me of personally what I'm comfortable in. Overalls, my favorite, well, I mean, one of my favorite categories. Of course, it's the denim category. My long and short overalls. And I've gone through a couple different overalls just, you know, through the months and years. Although it kind of makes me feel like a toddler, um, I will take it. Some of them I've gotten for very expensive prices and some of them I've gotten for like, under ten dollars so it's very up and down depending on where you find them dresses are another kind of wild card for me that i definitely wasn't really into until the past couple months honestly and this i definitely want to expand but honestly i'm proud that i even have any dresses <laughs> while filming this video i realized how many jackets that i have like just so many. Again, for somebody that lives in the hot region of Southern California, I first have all my blazers, which definitely am still trying to get used to just because they make me feel so professional. Then going into my other type of jackets, my faux leather jackets. Oh my gosh, I have this jacket that Carrie gave to me, I think, in the beginning of this year. So funky. Just so many. You know, for every single weather, I got like three different fuzzy jackets. What's funny is when I went to England, I was like solid in my temperature. I was able to bring a warm jacket and Carrie was like, I'm just not used to dressing for the cold weather. Technically, I'm not used to dressing for actual cold weather. It's just my pretend cold weather. But I'm always ready for whenever Southern California decides to actually get cold. All right, I'm sorry. This is my favorite category. My denim jacket 
collection. Again, some have left me through the years, but these are kind of like my solid ones that I'm just so in love with. Every single one is different. It is different. Let me tell you, some of them are cropped, some of them are not. Some of them I'm specifically going to use for patches. That way I can kind of customize them. And there's kind of something I'm planning on doing in the next couple of months um, that I would need some denim jackets. So that's also why I'm kind of like hoarding them. Same thing, some of them were like $50, some of them were $10. It was very, just the range was very all over the place. I even have my very first denim jacket that I ever thrifted from Goodwill for, I think it was like $10. And that's what started my love for them. I then just have some vests. I just figured I would include them. I don't really have like a bunch, but I got some funky ones, you know, with some Winnie the Pooh and then a cat one. Sweaters and cardigans are also my favorite thing. I love sweaters, just can't stop. Uh, I have this like snowman sweater that I've just been waiting for December and each sweater I try to make sure that they're not itchy or that they shed because if they're itchy and shed I probably won't wear them. I It's just another way of wearing just a sweatshirt but at least something a little bit more dressy. Not really dressy but you know what I mean. And although I have many cream sweaters, they're all different. Again, I feel like that's the overall theme of this video. They're all different, I promise you. I originally didn't know if I was gonna do sweatshirts, but then I was like, it's everything in my closet, I have to. But I have a lot of Disney ones because I love Disney. I have just some random ones. I'm just like a lover of sweatshirts, it's what I wear. I'm wearing one right now. Long sleeves just have a couple different things in this category. There's nothing just like a plain long sleeve, of course. All these are a little bit funky and different. I got some button ups in there. Got a Harley Davidson one. And I don't really wear a lot of long sleeves, to be honest. If I'm gonna wear something that's long sleeve, I'm gonna wear a sweater or a sweatshirt. And then some short sleeve tops. And I kind of included my button ups first just because, I mean, I don't have that many, but I just figured I would. But I don't really have a necessarily like theme I go for when I'm trying to thrift tops. I think I try, especially right now, to find ones that are a little bit like not just t-shirts, but then I do just have, you know, the plain, plain shirts and sweatshirts. Um, and then my Harley Davidson shirts. Yep, got them all. And then I just got some random t-shirts. I love like funky shirts as well. Like that's my favorite thing. And I used to thrift it all the time, but I just feel like the thrift store doesn't have that many. And then, you know, you got your dad on vacation dancing. Sleeveless tops are, you know, they're their own thing. I, I do find that when it comes to like tops, like I have a lot of similar ones. Personally, I try to stay away from the farmer's tan because I tan really fast. Although I really don't have that many sleeveless tops. So bags, I'm pretty basic with. I'm gonna be real, I don't wear a lot of the bags that I own. I mostly just wear my backpacks because in most cases I need a lot of stuff. I definitely used to be more of a hat person. Um, on the wall are like my bigger hats that I honestly don't wear. So that's why I'm not trying them on because I just use them for decoration now. I feel like hats don't look good on me anymore. Hopefully your opinion of me has not changed. I think we all knew I had a denim jacket problem. And of course, almost all these items have been thrifted. So if you do like thrifting videos, thrift hauls, thrifting with me, make sure you hit subscribe right down below and hit that little bell to be notified every time I make a new video. And also don't forget to follow me on Instagram and Twitter, alexsunshine83 to keep up to date with me during the week. And I will see you guys on Sunday with a brand new Sunny Sunday video. Enjoy life, be happy, and I love you lots.